right, hello everybody and welcome back to part two of Let's Play The Sims for High School Sweethearts. Um, so she's actually making some scrambled eggs, um, trying to at least. Um, she's not the best cook yet, so she's getting there though, she's getting there. Um, she's making a mess, but she's getting there. At least she didn't drop the salt in there this time. But, um, anyways, she's making some scrambled eggs for both of them. And she actually starts work in two hours. So, um, we will definitely be going to work with her. Um, and he starts in two days. So, he does not work today. And, um, I just wanted to kind of talk really fast. So, some people are like, oh my god, she has too much blush and too much of this and blah, blah, blah. Um, her blush is... It brings her personality. She actually doesn't have that much blush. I don't know if you guys thought it was too much because of the thumbnail or what, but she honestly has not that much blush. It's just bright. So, yeah. Um, but her thumbnail, or her thumbnail, her uh, blush is part of her personality. That's, you know, how she is. So, um, yeah. But I just wanted to clarify. And also, um... Um, people wanted me to make it so they had not that much money. Guys, they are, you know, a doctor and a tech guru. Yes, in reality, they're just starting their career, but they have been working at it for a couple of years. So, of course, they're going to have a lot of money. And someone is feeling flirty. Oh, snap. Let's go ahead and take a screenshot of this but yeah um so yeah they're gonna have a lot of money when um first turning out so yeah but anyways um once she's done eating let's go ahead and have her use the toilet and i'm actually what the fudge seriously we made you a freaking hearty breakfast and you could go decide to freaking grab a bur or burger a hamburger seriously you better be working out dude you better be working out I'm uh, just kidding. Um, so she's going to go ahead and take or go to the bathroom and then take a shower. Um, she doesn't really need, necessarily need it, but might as well lift up her all of her needs um, now. So let's go ahead and finish this up, hopefully before 7 or close anyways. Alrighty, so that was close enough. So now we are on to being a doctor or not really a doctor per se yet, but we're going to get up there. Um... All right, so welcome Mackenzie Hendri Kendrick to a vital and rewarding career in the field of medicine. Being new to the job takes some t being new to the top job takes some time getting familiarized with the location, the people, and the basic responsibilities of the profession. In time, with skill, dedication, and a passion to help her fellow Sims, Mackenzie will no doubt go far in her career. All righty. Here we go. So now we want to, or uh, we need to uh, greet two coworkers. So let's do a friendly introduction to him and a friendly introduction to him as well. And it looks like um, she wants to embrace Toby. So we'll go ahead and pin that down. All right. And then greet three patients. So let's do a friendly introduction to him. And then let's go ahead and um, treat the patient. Um, so there we go. And then we'll go treat this patient and do a friendly introduction to him as well. There we go. Alrighty. And then we got to treat the patient and do a friendly introduction, and she did not treat that patient. Seriously? Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. Alrighty, so now we need to discuss work with coworker, but let's first, you know, admit this patient. <clears throat> and possibly, oh, they're all kids, which is kind of sad. But we'll go ahead and do those two patients and mop up the puddle. I do like that in each, like, game, um, the sims change. So my get to work, the doctor is a man. And then the assistant, I think it's called. No, the nurse is a 
female. So I like how it kind of changes it all up in each game. Kind of, kind of cool. But, all right. I have the freaking hiccups. I don't know why I get the hiccups after every time I freaking start recording. It's so frustrating. But she's going to go mop up the puddles. Because for some reason there's puddles in the hospital, which is not safe at all. But whatever, whatever. Um, I wonder what this machine over here is. Um, perform treadmill test to perform this interaction. Oh, it doesn't really say anything. Hmm, interesting. <clears throat> Alright. So, it wants us to have a cup of coffee. So, we'll go ahead and brew some coffee for us. Just mopping up all the puddles. And I love this, like, area over here. It's so pretty. It's seriously like a city. Like, I don't know. Let me go over here. Kind of show you guys. Like, there's cars. You know, it's cool. I like it. It just sucks that this is the only lot we can basically use. But, <clears throat> it works. Alright. So, now it wants us to... Uh, okay, well... Discuss work with coworker. So let's do a friendly introduction to her. And we'll go ahead and discuss work. Awesome, there we go. Alright, since she's on the computer, go ahead and research health reports. And we'll go ahead and I guess that works. She's already <coughs> Freaking A. She's already chatting with her. So, let's do some more, you know, friendly or interactions. Um, we too got patients to worry about. Mortimer Goth is sick. How freaking sad. And it's uh, Nina C Katrina. Sorry. That's cool. Okay. So, let's go ahead and admit the patient. Um... And it wants to um, complain about work to a co-worker. And Mortimer actually looks like he has all the, like, basically tiger stripes on him. So, that's pretty funny. Alright, so it wants us to... Uh, let's go ahead and take the temperature and discuss general health. Um, Alright, and we'll go ahead and deliver food. Alrighty. Now we'll go ahead and um, chat with a patient. So we'll go ahead and ask about day. There we go. And we need to make some beds. Do we have any bed to make? Yes, we do. Perfect. Um, it looks like we can't really um, basic like uh, what should we call it? um cure anybody right now um like well we can treat them but you know d d d d d figure out what's wrong with them okay um go ahead and wash our hands we're actually gonna stay late as well and what actually what does she need attend an active work day as a doctor career venue okay that's fine um Okay, so we need to grab a snack. Is she hungry? Mm, yeah, a little bit. I'll go ahead and grab a sandwich. She was going to read her baking volume one. All right, there we go. Perfect. Okay, go ahead and clean that up once you're done. And we should be good to head home here soon. So we'll go ahead and actually treat Mortimer. Um, since we're, we can, so go ahead and treat him. And we've got a lot of sims over here, and it looks like, uh, Katrina is actually looks dazed, apparently. Um, but, you know, we don't have time to kind of put them in the bed or anything like that, so. Perfect. Alright. Mackenzie is gonna get off work here soon. Let's go ahead and make that bed. And let's go ahead and deliver food to him. Okay. What else can we do with the patients? Make a bed. Eh, we don't got any beds to make right now. They're all being used. Alright. So we have 13 minutes. So I'm not too worried about anything right now. Okay. 
So she got 188 simoleons for work today. <clears throat> Which is um, pretty average, so that's good. And it looks like um, she should get a promotion the next time she goes into work. So that's good. Um, but all right. So I was thinking of going on a little date with a man. So let me go ahead and make sure everything, you know, is good. Like, you know, bladder hygiene and all of that fun stuff. And we'll go ahead and go on a little outing and a little date. Um, I'm going to go ahead and actually place a venue down. So I will be right back. Alrighty, so I went ahead and put down a cute little bakery from the um, gallery. So we're going to go ahead and come visit this bakery and pro basically just, you know, chillax and have a couple pastries and stuff like that. Maybe, hopefully, you know, unless no one's going to come. I just don't know. No workers, nothing. Nothing. Do we have to hire? Do we have to buy this? What's going on? Um, I guess she could go downstairs and make some cupcakes. So let's go ahead and bake. Um, let's bake some donut holes. Apparently, because no one else is here. So um, he's already freaking hungry. Don't. Okay, he's only drinking that. All right. So I guess we'll get something to eat. As she's still in her work clothes. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Okay, so now let's go ahead and come place, place this upstairs because I'm not sure exactly how it all works. Um, like, as far as, like, um, the bakeries, I haven't really messed around with it too, too much. So, um, actually, we can actually, um, what is it? Um, called to mill. There we go. There we go. Okay, both of them are gonna grab one. Perfect. They're sitting next to each other. Sweet. So these actually look pretty um tasty. Um, in a way. I mean, they are only don donut holes. So, all right. But let's go ahead and flirt a little bit. Express fondness. Um, compliment appearance. Um, if anybody can tell me how the whole bakery freaking system w works and why there's nobody working, that would be awesome. Unless we have to run the bakery. We can't have one that's not being run. And I hear Elijah waking up too. So, um, I might have to go take care of him and come back here in a few. But let's go ahead and blow a kiss and ask a risque question. They're like, oh yeah. <laughs> All right, um, let's go ahead and caress cheeks since they're both done. And I guess it's just kind of romantic. You know, they have a place of their own. And um, Alyssa Yang Jing, some, somebody's over there. And why is, whoa, wait, is this? Okay, I don't know if you guys can see it. Unless it's just my... Do you see that aurora around the sim? Or is it just me? Um, I'm not sure if you guys can see it, but... Um, my brain must be messing with me or something, but... Um, I want him to actually meet the sim because... Um, I could be mistaken, but... It might be an alien unless, I don't know. Um, do a friendly introduction to him, come on. I'm probably messing with my brain because I really want a, an alien. I'm not sure, can't really tell. Um, let's do, ask about day. I know this is a date for them, but. 
It's okay. And apparently, she's getting the gaming skill. Okay. She actually wants to go read her baking book. So, hey. At least she's, you know, making some advancing in her baking skill, apparently. So, alright. I don't know if Ernest is a alien or not, but it, that would be kind of cool. Just saying. Okay. So, um, let's go ahead and embrace him and flirt and compliment appearance and what's wrong with you hmm i don't know they've connected so well which is i'm so happy um all right so let's see profess undying love let's go ahead and off for rose and there he is so i will be back all right so i'm probably gonna go ahead and cut this uh part short but i'm going to go ahead and actually um hopefully get them engaged um let me see i'm not sure if we can do that on the slot or not but um i kind of want to get them engaged um, so that, uh, we can, you know, boost up their relationship, get them married, and then go from there. And then this way, I won't matter, or I won't care, oh, there we go, I won't care about having them, you know, have a baby. Go ahead and take a picture of this. Super cute. Yes. Yay. That's adorable. They always look weird. Okay. Their head is like wobbling back and forth. I don't know. Anyways. So they are engaged. So um, we're going to go ahead and head on home. Um, so go home, guys. Go home. Both of y'all, go home. All right. There we go. Um, they're working their way on down over there there we go and then before i end this part i'm gonna have them you know do the hooing um and kind of see if you know we can get them pregnant but you need to get up first so get up and come over here and um go ahead and try for a baby um and then we'll most likely become pregnant. It's pretty easy to get pregnant in this game. And I've, I've only had a couple times where it actually never worked the very first time. So we'll um, let them go to sleep afterwards. And I'll just continue fast forwarding until the morning. And then we'll go ahead and do the, um, you know, uh, pregnancy test when they both wake up. So, oh, well, he's up. He got to go to the bathroom. So we'll go ahead go back to bed and um she's gonna be up in just a second anyways so i'm just gonna go ahead and have her take pregnancy test and um we'll see see eating for two congratulations mackenzie is expecting there's going to be a new addition to the household and wow for once they she doesn't actually immediately have a baby bump wow is it because of the way she's you know, dressed or let's go ahead and put her in everyday outfit really fast. Yup, nope, sh no, no baby. Um, that's crazy. But all right, so I'm gonna go ahead and actually have her just um have a quick meal of cereal. But I'm gonna go ahead and end this part right here because um she is gonna be starting work in a, like 30, 40 minutes or whatever. Um, and he starts working four hours, so I don't want to, you know, go to work with her again in this part, but I hope you guys enjoyed this, and I hope you guys are enjoying this new Let's Play, um, and I hope you guys have an awesome, awesome day, and I will talk to you guys all in my next video. Bye, everyone.